He was a man of vision, a man of logic, a truly original thinker who possessed an extraordinary mind and a remarkable will. Alan Matheson Turing saw things in entirely new ways and created a theoretical machine that altered the course of human history. In 1936, he launched the modern computer era with his classic paper on computable numbers in which he conceived an amazingly simple device that captured the notion of what it meant to compute. He then proved that his universal Turing machine could compute anything that was computable. During World War II, working in secret at the Government Code and Cipher School at Bletchley Park, he co-designed an electromechanical computing device known as the bomb. His team of code breakers then used it to successfully crack the complex Enigma codes used by the German U-boats to strangle Allied shipping lanes. In 1945, Turing led the team that designed the automatic computing engine, or ACE, an important early electronic digital computer. But perhaps his greatest accomplishment came in 1950 while on the faculty at the University of Manchester. There, he published Computing Machinery and Intelligence. In it, he developed the criterion, now known as the Turing Test, to determine whether or not a machine could actually think. His ideas and this experiment are now widely acknowledged as the foundation for artificial intelligence. We can only imagine what further contributions Turing might have made to computing had his brilliant career not been so unjustly derailed. Homosexuality was still a crime in England in 1952. Turing, when accused of a related offense, pleaded guilty, despite the fact that he felt no guilt. As a result of his conviction, he lost his security clearance and his job as a codebreaker and died just two years later. Almost a half a century later, Prime Minister Gordon Brown issued a formal apology on behalf of the British government. A royal pardon would follow, and later, enactment of the Alan Turing Law, which officially pardoned the tens of thousands of men wrongfully prosecuted by the now repealed laws. In honor of his remarkable scientific achievements, the Association for Computing Machinery instituted the ACM AM Turing Award in 1966. Today, it is universally recognized as computing's most prestigious award, often referred to as its Nobel Prize, given to those remarkable individuals who, like Alan Turing, have made lasting contributions of major technical importance to advancing computer science.